All right, so just to give an update on um, one of my projects, I was going to show you guys some stuff. I got actually a bunch of stuff, but let me show you what I'm doing. I picked up these cherry timbers. They're landscape timbers, and uh, they were, let's see, 275 each. So this is going to be the main foundation of my uh, garden enclosure. So right here, I got them at North 40. Ended up paying, I don't know if you guys can see that because it's so bright out, $58.30. And then what I got is I'm going to make like a poor man's aquaponics type of setup. And this is really all over the internet. I think the guy's name is Larry Hall that um, kind of invented this system or he's the one that's actually pushing a lot of it. And it's a gutter type of irrigation system for your garden and your planters once you get those up. So I still have to build them, but I got all the material I need right here to build them. I got my gutters. Dude, these were so cheap. They were like four bucks. He said they're going to be eight, but I think I paid 384 for them or something like that. I spent just over $68, but I got a military discount at Home Depot, which is cool. Thanks, Home Depot. 10% off. So now I got this stuff. I got the end caps. These were the most expensive part. They were eight bucks, but that comes with two end caps. And then I got various other things for another project. I got some of this furring strip that I got to use for trim work for something else. So that's not included in this. But right now with my garden set up, I think I'm about maybe 150 bucks in for the size of the garden that I'm going to build. So it's going to be interesting. Once it's all done and set up, I'll show you guys exactly what it looks like. And then I'll also make a, some videos about how my gardening's going. And then this poor man, what, what I'm calling, they're calling it a, gut, a gutter gardening. I just call it like a poor man aquaponics, which is basically what it is. I still have to go get rainwater barrels because I want to uh, put, a, put a ball valve on my system so I don't have to water it all the time. Then I can just come over here, put a hose on my spigot, and then um, fill it up out of my well. Or maybe make a rainwater diversion system. I haven't decided yet. So stay in tune and subscribe and like tell me what you guys want to see i still have to lay the foundation that i'm going to put down i'm just going to do some like simple weed mat and then cinder block it all level and then some uh regular blocks and then i'm going to put this together i got toggle screws last time to or to put all this stuff together so that's going to go in there and then um, i got some siding from an old project that i did that i'm going to side it with and then i'm going to throw it up start getting me a good garden coming in this year Subscribe and like. Tell me what you want to see. Bye.